So that's uh, Megisto Chimella. It's a satyr. That's our second satyr species for the day here in this trail. Dude, why is he flying so calmly now? That's how they usually fly. That's how they fly. They actually feed on this stuff right here. What is that? It's like a, kind of some kind of cane. Sugar cane. It's like a, in the grass family. That's what they eat. So, here we go. I wonder if I can get a video of one of these damselflies. Beautiful damselfly. It's got this bright green abdomen. How close will he let me get? Not very. Oh, cool. Well, they are cool. Okay, first trap is super close. I cannot see up into the top. This trap is really falling apart here, guys, so I don't have a whole lot of confidence in its structural integrity. But let's see. Anything? Okay. <clears throat> Bait looks good. Still can't see it. There's a yellow jack there's yellow jackets inside, which is not fun. Alright guys, unfortunately I don't see anything in trap number one. Yeah. Guys, zero in trap number one. Except yellow jackets. So that is not a good thing, guys. I'm going to empty this out and move on. Okay. There's a, there's a butterfly. So there's satyrs. All over the place Doesn't in here good, Dad. well our next trap I don't see a whole lot hanging in it it's not good man I'm not sure what's going on I just don't see a whole lot let's see Not a whole lot going, guys. Oh boy. So our watermelon, this is our watermelon trap, guys. And our watermelon trap, it looks like, is a complete bust. How is that possible? There's nothing in it, zero, not even insects. Not a good sign. Not good at all, guys. So, watermelon? I don't know, guys. Um, there's a... Uh, it's got a long leg spider underneath, but that's not what we're here for. Guys, uh, hopefully we can figure out something better with our other traps, but the watermelon one really didn't do any good. So, not a good sign for the other traps either. Okay guys, good news. We're coming up to our peach filled trap and I got news for you. We've got some uh, Lepidopteran life inside of our trap. Oh, it's gonna rain. It is gonna rain soon. It looks like we have a Catacoma moth and a pearly eye of some kind. So, Oh, that's all poison on you. Yeah. Oh, damn. Oh, it's so good. I have my perfect face in here. 
This the freaking rope is nasty. Wow, that one's different. His eyes are bigger. Come on. Don't touch that plant. No, poison no, no. ivy, man. Poison ivy, Lorenzo. Bad, 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 bad. Okay. <laughs> well, can you hold this? Got this it. in place? I can hold that. All right. Got it. Okay, guys. After I got some uh, poison ivy all over me, which is not good, I'm now going to look into... Do you want me to pee on it? No, that doesn't help. <laughs> all right. We, we do have a catocala moth in here, which is really good. And we've got some pearly ice. So, guys, we have our peach bait. It is performing. It's performing. Uh, so, I'm going to unzip. Don't scratch your neck or your face. Yeah. Okay. What I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to show you our, our pearly eye, northern pearly eye, or is it southern pearly eye? I'm not sure which one it is, guys. I'm going to take her home and see if I can get some eggs. I've got also a red catocala of some sort. Um... There's a red catocala moth. Look at that beauty. So that's a good sign, guys. So far, our peach flavored bait has performed the best. We've got that beautiful red catocala moth. And we've got two pearly eyes in here. So um, I'm super happy about that, guys. Let me see if I can get... see pearly eyes are beautiful and that's a gorgeous one very very fresh i think it's portlandia i think they're called no that's a yeah, what is it that's another, another cedar yeah another cedar pretty, pretty white. oh look at how beautiful that red catocala moth is guys all right we're gonna get an id on the moth and we'll go from there guys all right guys i'm gonna get this catocala moth in a jar because that's what we do. All right, We've got that nice red catocala, and we're gonna get an ID on that for you very shortly, guys. Whoa, beautiful catocala moth! Wow, wait, is it a male? Dad, do you think we should hurry up? Well, son, we are. We are, yeah. All right, let me help you if you need, tell me if you need help. It's a male or female? I think it's a male, it's a male. How do you tell? Yeah, let me see the other one in there. I think there was another one. Did she get out? There definitely were two. And it must have gotten out. Oh, no, it's there. Playing tricky. All right, guys. So this is a pearly eye. And it's got some miles on it. And it's a male. So we're going to let this guy fly. Bye-bye. But bye. it's a beautiful butterfly. So sayonara, dude. All right, guys. Peach trap. we got a catocala moth two pearly eyes I, that's so far the best trap out of the watermelon now we got one more apple based trap and we're going to see how that goes guys let's go check that trap now all right guys we are about to get poured on guys you a little nervous about this or what no not no, really we don't mind a little, little wet we don't mind a little wet all right guys we have we're checking our apple bait trap the peach trap just did really well uh our our other one with, oh, there goes a butterfly. Lorenzo, get him if you can. All right, so what we're going to do, guys, our peach trap did, oh, boy. We're going to get rained on, guys. Yeah, please. Here, here, here. 
crap. What? We're gonna get Our uh, our trap with the peaches did okay. We got a Kataka moth and two uh, pearly eyes. Guys, I got news for you. The apple trap is is blowing us out of the water here. We've got some good bugs in this thing, man. Check this out, guys. Let me kind of open up the zipper. We've got we've got an Abbott's Sphinx right here, guys. We've got a bunch of hornets. We've got a Katakala moth up here. Oh my gosh, guys, my trap is full of, of yellow jackets and white-faced hornets. That's kind of making me a little nervous. Guys, we've got a lot more insect activity in this. I am not gonna sit here and have my hand in this trap, but we've got, we've got pearly eyes all over the place. I've got an Abbott Sphinx but I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine pearly eyes, guys, in this one trap. So uh, the apple trap, guys, the apple bait trap is the one that did the best. Uh, hope you liked the video. I'm gonna get this done before the rain starts, but I hope you guys see all the butterflies in here. Let me see if I can get a couple good images. All right, we got one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pearly eyes. Um, a zolly, look at the zolly. Cute little zolly. Awesome. All right, so guys, um, hope you liked the video. Give me a thumbs up. If you wanna learn more about bait trapping, if you guys have any suggestions on uh, what type of bait you'd like to use, Guys, drop me a comment on what kind of bait has worked best for you. Uh, if you want to know more about it, shoot me a comment. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Pops, you have fun? I had a great time. Good. We had a good yeah, time. We were ending up on a good note here. On a good note, guys. We, yeah, we, our first three traps weren't so hot. We did okay on the, on the peach trap, but this one, we got eight Portlandia in there and it's an Abbott Sphinx. Fantastic. Guys, Till next time, let's get out there and find some bugs. Take care now.